Hello YouTube, this is a gameplay video for Alliance of Valiant's Arms running on my 27 inch iMac. Uh, I am playing with all these settings all the way up as seen right here. Um, so yeah, let's let's get started. I already made a couple videos but I forgot a couple settings so let's just do it now. Okay, so here we are with, wow, everything, everything up, and it actually runs, it's not full frame rate. Um, it's probably around 20, 25 frames per second, probably more like 25. Uh, and for an IJJI game, it looks surprisingly good. Like, I'm thoroughly surprised by that, actually. Um, wow. Like, almost, you know like Call of Duty or any other game quality, like by a major development studio. Maybe I'm mistaken on this whole, like, IJJI isn't that, like, you know, I don't, I don't know where I'm getting at there, but, you know, generally I associate their games with not that great of graphics. All right, well, this is kind of laggy at the same time, or not laggy, but uh, it's not running at the frame rate I really want, so let's change that. Advanced, and we're just going to turn off anti-aliasing and um, V-Sync as well. Let's turn off that. Okay, here we are with everything all the way up and no anti-aliasing or uh, V-Sync. And it runs really well. I'm actually getting a smooth frame rate. There is so much recoil with this, it's unbelievable. I'm really bad. I'm like, really fucking bad. Maybe I should try being a sniper. Probably be even worse. <laughs> hey! Oh, that's right, bitch. Yeah, one kill. Oh, shit. Yeah, I think there's a way to... Yeah, here. Uh, no, I want to be um, sniper. There we go. Next, next round. Or next time I die. I'm going to hope there's a guy right here. No. Am I even anywhere? That was a wasted opportunity. See, I don't really know how it works in this game, but I guess you really have to just load them up. <laughs> More than that, I guess. Or people sniping. Uh, come on. I'm really bad at sniping, too. Alright, I'm not going to bother trying any other uh, game settings as this runs really well. Um, you know, I just saw a little bit of a screen tear right there. I'm not sure if you can see it in the video, but V-Sync might actually be um, good for this game. Um, I don't really know what happened there. Oh, wow! I actually got him. Holy shit, I got someone with a sniper in this game. Probably my first sniper kill, I don't even know. Oh 
shed. Come on. Prick. Wait, wait. Can I get his foot? Uh, ah, where'd he go? I wanted to get his foot. I'm so bad. I'm unbelievably bad. Surprised I'm not dead yet. Oh! Another kill! Wow. That is incredible. Truly incredible. Alright. Alright. Alright, pistol. I'm gonna, I'm gonna run in with the pistol. Oh! I think that was a headshot. That was a good spree. What was that? Two kills? Three kills? I don't even know. That was incredible. I'm not going positive yet, though. Oh, wow. I think I'm just gonna forget about the gameplay video and start playing. What is this? I get little things that mark where they are now. That's neat. I like that. Oh. Uh, come on. Frick. Come on, come out. Come out. Oh, what happened? Are we done? Guess we're done. Switching sides. Alright, well, you know, this has been a gameplay video for Alliance of Valiant Arms, running on my 27-inch iMac. Um, I wouldn't play with anti-aliasing or vertical sync unless you really need it, and I'm sure you can mess around with the other settings, but uh, the point is, if you want to, you know, get boot camp and Windows 7 and, and get this free-to-play game, then I'm sure you'll have a great time, and I know it will run smoothly on your iMac. And again, 2010 model, but hey, if you get a top-of-the-line, or one of the top-of-the-line 2011 models, it'll run fantastic, I'm sure. But um, I don't have one, so you'll just have to deal with this. Alright, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.